Julia Quantivalli trains twice a day, five times a week, as she plots her path to glory at the London Games. Living up to the exploits of four years ago, though, will take some doing. In Beijing, she was practically an unknown before making history by becoming the first Italian woman to win a judo medal as she topped the podium in the under-57 class. And her coach, Felice Mariani, a bronze medal winner from the 1976 Games in Montreal, feels that she has all the attributes for further success. She has a good sense of balance, even if this has been lacking a little bit recently. She has a particular physical condition, which means she is on average bigger than her opponents. Yet sport has a habit of cutting down its heroes. Since Beijing, Quantivalli has struggled. She flopped at the European Championships in April this year and has slipped to number 10 in the world rankings. After Beijing, it was really hard for me, because when you have a gold medal, you really feel its weight on your shoulders when you compete. You have to show that you are capable, and you have to win. Beforehand, I was more relaxed, as I wasn't among the favourites. The clock is now ticking ahead of London, and with her coach behind her, Quantevalli hopes to make amends and put four years of disappointment behind her with a second Olympic gold.